So, you know, most nations uh, across Asia have set net zero targets for 2030, 2050, 2070. Our research at Ecosystem shows that 70% enterprises across Asia have a focus on sustainability. What is going to encourage organizations to start to put that focus on the planet and really start to drive that purpose economy. The citizens of the world today are demanding a better planet for the future. I think just let's start there, right? Secondly, there's a lot more ownership that investors are having. There's investor activism. So are you seeing um, you know, a big shift in organizations to start to actually gear up for the next generation of talent that's coming in? I think the shift that's, that's happening is personalizing the sustainability agenda so that it starts to feel more meaningful at an individual level. So What's the sort of considerations enterprises need to have with respect to data, but also the digital engineer, engineering or infrastructure that they need? You, you mentioned data. I think there is a, a lack of standard, um, lack of uh, automation in the way we, we collect the data and analyze the data. I think there is a lack of structured taxonomy and alignment to the SDG goals. 90% of the consumers in Asia are willing to pay more for sustainable products, but they are held back because of lack of visibility and transparency on, is it really sustainable? Tell, tell, tell me more about it. So I think technology and data can really play a, a, a huge role in terms of enabling these transparencies and, and this visibility.